Um, so what I do every Wednesday, uh, a Golder Associates who sample our skinks and our skink enclosure, they come in every once in a while and they help me, they teach me how to sample skinks. So that could be lifting up corrugated iron or um, like lifting up bricks to see whether or not um, rainbow skinks or copper skinks are within those artificial habitats and it also could even be within like grass and, and bush area. So it's basically to find like a really good idea about how many pests maybe, if, whether or not we're refining skinks, mm. um, the number of skinks that are in there and what types. Okay. Last year, 2010, I did a gecko seat, which we got the inspiration from the um, lizard enclosure outside, and we made a two metre by one metre seat for the school, so we could leave our um, heritage behind. Yeah. Legacy. Yeah. Um, we used all the colours of the uh, house houses and incorporated all the school into our seat, so we could have it on display as an art piece. And this year? And this year I'm doing Gateway, which is me going into Jazz Mix every Wednesday, an architecture firm in Parnell, and I learn how architects work and to see if I want to be an architect when I'm older. I've always um, looked at being an architect, but I didn't necessarily know what they do, so when I go into Jazz Mix they teach me what I've got to do and what are the key things in being an architect. Hmm. Um, I've been doing it for the last year and a half, maybe even more than that, but I started off taking a concept that had gone in my family, so you know, we talked about it and things like that, but I took it further and took it into the new, the new future, I guess, mm -hmm. going on online. Um, it's me and Danny that are setting up our own online, like Seek, but better. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's just an online CV service that provides um, video, interactive, the company's able to contact the applicant as well as the applicant able to talk to the the company, um, you know, little messages and applying for jobs. So it is like Seek, but there is that more interactive with pictures, videos, and possibly, um, like, we can be act as a recruiting agency as well, so seeing if they've got um, the right skills, the things that they're looking for, and actually forwarding it on to the company as well. Um, so yeah, it's, it's getting there, it's live today. Good, yeah. so it's thank good. you. My project is on unveiling New Zealand history and it's a graphic non-fiction book on um, New Zealand history um, before the treaty. Um, it starts with a um, it starts with a myth on Maui and the fish and then it goes through how um, the um, explorers came and then how the European settlers started coming in to make money. And then it comes, and then oh, the conflicts between the Maori and the Europeans. So that's like the boy. And then the how the missionaries um, established literacy and stuff in New Zealand. And then it ends with the um, signing of the treaty. Go through it, yeah. Um, yeah. So it ends. Um, yeah, it ends with the signing at the end. Good. Well, um, in my impact project, I um, am creating and producing music. I'm producing um, dubstep and drumstep. Um, I am, me and my friend Aaron, we make it every Wednesday and we also do it um, not in school time. We are producing um, a CD and an album, so we have to go through the steps of creating the album art and getting all the um, uh, CDs and all the um, CDs duplicated and put all the music on it. We have to run a business to find if we're going to make profit from it, find places where we're going to sell it. Um, where we've been working on it for the whole year. It's a whole year impact project and um, it's been really good so far. We're nearly finished all of the songs and about to wrap it up in the next few weeks. So, yeah.